Supreme Court ruling could make a drastic impact to the tourism industry and clean drinking water here in the low country. The ruling would only protect wetlands connected to larger regulated bodies of water and would no longer protect any scattered wetlands like what you might see in Cane Hoy or the Francis Marion National Forest. Anna Harris spoke with the environmental activist today about why this ruling is crucial. It really puts at stake everything that our community is built on here in the low country. A new Supreme Court ruling will now impact which wetlands are federally protected. With no state level protections in place either, some wetlands can no longer do their job. And so the real concern here is it's going to make it easier to do fill and build type development. It's going to make it easier to destroy those wetlands. It's going to make it easier to pave over top of them. And what that means is it means more polluted water for the community. It means loss of habitat for wildlife. And it means just dirty water and more flooding for the community. Another environmental advocacy nonprofit says some places are more at risk from this ruling than others. I think the Supreme Court really gave into the demands of big polluters and is leaving the most vulnerable among us, including indigenous communities, uh, communities of color, um, and those most vulnerable to pollution and intensifying climate disasters at risk. But why would the Supreme Court want to take away protections? One nonprofit environmental law firm says they are not sure. The waters of the United States definition has changed so many times over the years and it's proven to be a flimsy mechanism to actually protect what's important in our state. And that's why we need stronger state and local protections. Milton says this doesn't mean treatment of wetlands should become a free for all and to contact your state and local legislators if you wish to see a change. Check and make sure that you know, the wetlands that you have on any property that you own are protected. Everybody needs to do their part. In Mount Pleasant, Anna Harris, Live 5 News.